just found out that an old guy that I helped out quite a bit in Chatham. He was an old guy named Riley. Um, Uncle Riley, a lot of people called him. Uh, he used to be uh, work at the um, Blenheim Arena. Um, driving the Zamboni and whatnot. Uh, he was just an old alcoholic. Um, a good heart until beer touched his lips or any alcohol. Um, we knew how drunk he was by how many times he'd yell, fucking goose, at the top of his lungs at the cops. <laughs> right in downtown Chatham. <laughs> and uh, when people brag about, you know, oh, I beat up like six cops, I don't know. He actually did. <laughs> Even at his age of 60. <laughs> when they never just sent one cop to deal with him. They sent quite a few. <laughs> so, um, at least he's at peace. He was a troubled soul. He, he cried several occasions on my shoulder. And uh, like I said, he was a good man. He was just, he was an alcoholic and he was troubled. And I'm going to miss him. I missed him already. When I left Chatham, I missed him right away. So, but he lived a long life. Well, yeah, he lived, he lived his life. So I'm not so sad about his death because he's at peace. And he was so troubled. Um, now, the other ones that I've had to deal with, are, they're all younger, tragic, and... I'm not going to talk about it anymore. Talk to you later. Bye. I'm going to eat my chicken that I just cooked. And probably watch some Rick and Morty. And probably cry some more. <laughs> and pet my dog. Love you all. Peace, love, and happiness.